Hi everyone, I'm Carla Cannon and I wanted to share my super, super simple approach to numbers and math for your children in the early years, uh, starting at about age three through their pre-K and into kindergarten. So I'm all about things being simple and fun, especially when they're, we're working with really little ones. So of course we just did lots of counting throughout our days, um, so they kind of just learned how to count. And then when it came to learning how to write and form numbers, we used an app. Now we have an iPad, but I'm sure you can get it um, on Android as well. And it's called Iggy Numbers 1 through 10. And this is a really cute app. So before our kids even, you know, held a pen or pencil, then um, they could learn to make it, you know, just with their finger and that was a good fit. So on the app, they can do the numbers or they can do, you know, practice their counting as well. It has kind of both options for you. And then you just pick whatever number you want them to work on. And then eat for each number, they have four different um, activities. So they can do a dot to dot, they can copy the number, and then draw the number freehand, you know, without actually copying anything, and then a little counting game. So this is really simple, but oh so powerful because by the time I gave my kids a pencil or a marker to do their actual, you know, to form them, they already, they had it down. And what's fun about this is that um, when they're doing it, it won't let them do it wrong. So that sounds kind of mean, but what it does is it reinforces um, proper formation of the, the numbers. There, there's an app for letters as well. It's called Iggy Alphabet. So um, for example, this is the number two here, and then it, you know, it pops up so it shows them what direction to make it. And then if you go to copy it and you go off, they'll say, oops, <laughs> try again. And then you can do it again. And so then that's nice because then you're not reinforcing strange, bad habits when it comes to doing it. So anyways, that was kind of the first thing um, on top of counting for number formation was the Iggy number app. And then I am a huge fan of Math Seeds. You can get um, a combined Math Seeds and Reading Eggs account, um, but Math Seeds really is great for really young kids. I think reading eggs, they have to be, you know, more, a little bit older because it progresses fairly quickly. But I started all my kids at about age three, you know, three and a half, four years old or so with the math seeds. And it starts just with numbers. Like this is one and they have all kinds of things to do with one and they move through each of the numbers. And it's a much slower rate than the reading eggs program. So quite young children can start on that. And my kids love it. It's very, you know, user friendly, bright games and animation and graphics. And so really they do that and they learned their numbers, counting, addition, all, and the program goes through third grade. So it's really comprehensive. And, um, you know, I help them if they need it, but it's something that they can do pretty independently as well. So that's great because it can buy me a little bit of time to work with one of my older kids. So between the Iggy Alpha, or sorry, the Iggy Number app, as well as the Math Seeds, that has formed pretty much the basis of our math. And then the only other thing I've done, and, and this is like all the way through kindergarten that I'm referring to, um, is I will get uh, some type of a book. I like the Kuman books, Kuman book of numbers, uh, one through 30, just so when they are developmentally ready to have a pencil, that they can practice making their numbers. Um, you know, it gives them lots of guidance through here and counting and all that all the way up through 30. There's cute little, you know, dot to dot, counting, tracing. It, it's nice. It's not complicated. And this is really what I use um, even in kindergarten because they are getting the adding, the subtracting, all those skills doing math seeds. And I pay close enough attention that I, I know whether they're getting it or not. And then really this is just to uh, reinforce writing the numbers and that's it my kids have learned everything they've needed through kindergarten 
uh, with kind of using those three things. And best of all, they love it and can be pretty independent. So it's win-win for all of us.